what is up my crazy subscriber this is joking jones 84 and welcome to the off season of uh season four um well actually after season three you know pretty much of a sad ending but uh, we gotta continue and maybe win the next super bowl you know we still have so many chances and uh, hopefully we do have a uh, a positive record again and uh, hopefully you know the tough opponents can settle down because I know I can take them all out so anyways let's start off the season by signing in new players and the, one of the biggest signs could be Brandon Marshall we are finally gonna be buying Brandon Marshall the reason why is because I know people are gonna be start blitzing uh, start to blitz and maybe press coverage so that means having a tall receiver with a bunch of release can allow me to get those receivers to get to go outside I mean, if you press a guy who has like around 95 release, you're pretty much going to be screwed. Because once that guy breaks that block, he's gone. You just lob it to the receiver and he'll be wide open. So six foot four, Brandon Marshall can actually do that. So a 93 release, he can do anything he wants if he's pressed. So uh, I, I believe this is going to be a good sign. You know, wasting this many coins just for Brandon Marshall, I think it could be worth it. So... I mean, he was one of my priorities to get because I know he was like one of the best ground and pound receivers out there. So, what else could I sign? I mean, I couldn't sign anybody else. So, anyways, Brandon Marshall is now on my team, and hopefully, he does good. And now for an extra, guys, this is gonna be, be a surprise sign up. So, um, here's a bonus: we're gonna be signing in a new center, who I found out he's pretty much cheap, like around 20 G's now. I don't understand like back in the day when I bought Nick Mango like for 30 G's or 20 G's. I don't know why I couldn't just get like this right now. So, I'm going to end up buying an elite center. His name is Max Unger. Pretty much has a lot of impact blocking, a lot of run blocking, which means he's going to block pretty much well. So, we're going to be able to sign Max Unger to our team. The better our linemen, the better the blocking, and the better the yardage. So, we're going to try to excel on our running game even more. We're going to try to get over 100 plus yards per game now now that we have kind of a better o-line kind of and maybe a receiver a better receiver on the outside too because if you guys get like a ground and pound receiver that receiver is going to block for you like no matter what so pretty much a ground and pound skill is going to be leveling the level by so much and uh, it's going to be very powerful to you so Brandon Marsh and this new guy is going to increase our team by so much and there's a comparison with Hearns and Brandon Marsh I know Brandon Marsh is kind of slow but he can get out there, man. At least he, he ain't that slow like Vincent Jackson. Vincent Jackson, maybe six foot five, but he doesn't have any acceleration going on. So that guy's gonna take off for it. It's gonna take forever for him to take off. So, so yeah. So there it is, Max Unger, and I have 55 players so in total. I gotta remove this guy from the lineup. So there's Max Unger. We're gonna have this team rolling for sure this season. Uh, maybe more rushing yards. I don't know, but. We gotta get to the ball, man. No more bullshit, no more anything. We're gonna go in here like with a vengeance. There's just no way I missed that Super Bowl, man. There's just no way. So that's it for now, guys. You guys think this is a good sign, you know, with Brandon Marshall and Max Unger? Please let me know in the comment section. And also, if you guys like the series, make sure you leave a like to support the series. So I'll see you guys later and subscribe for more.